We're going to make some Jiffy cornbread corn muffins, but we are going to do it Willie style. So it's going to be a whole different twist to it. So I got two boxes of this um, in this bowl right here. We are going to use a uh, half a stick of butter for the two boxes, some sugar, and it, you put as much sugar in it as you want. Now I've got to melt this butter, then we're going to add that here. I thought I had some cream uh, corn. I would normally put cream corn in it. For two boxes of the Jiffy Mix, I put a whole can of cream corn, but uh, unfortunately I don't have it. One box calls for one egg, so since we have two boxes, we're going to put two eggs. Then it calls for one third cup of milk. So we're going to put one, two. Two of those because we got two boxes. And then in goes the butter. Now the butter is melted but it's not hot. You're going to take a whisk and just whisk it. Like I said, if I had some cream corn, I would have put that in there. You also can put in sour cream. Sour cream helps moisten it and so does the cream corn. There we go. Right, we spray this with some non-stick cooking oil. We're gonna put the muffin mix in here. I don't feel like making no muffins, so we're gonna just do it in a pan. Alrighty, let's get the bacon on 400 for 20 minutes. We're gonna taste it in front of y'all, right on the spatula. Mm. Yeah. No, I'm not lying. That's good. That's how cornbread's supposed to taste. Yep. Mm-hmm. Moist. You can taste the cornmeal in it. Everything. It's good. Mm, I could eat this by itself. Say true. Now, if I had my sour cream or canned corn in it, it would have been a lot moister. But this is good. Mm. I guess it'd been better if I put it on a plate, wouldn't it? Anyway, I'm about to get off of here. Mm. Thumbs up this video. And subscribe to my channel if you're not a subscriber. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.